Hello there folks, these are the hands of me Dan Brown from Sort of Interesting and this, I'm very excited to say, is a Midori Traveller's Notebook and more than that, this is the Passport Size Star Edition and if you're wondering why it's called the Star Edition, as that does seem a random word to throw in um, it is based on, as you can see there, the Star Ferry which operates in, um, well if we flip over on the back uh, the Star Ferry operates in a harbour crossings between Kowloon Peninsula and Hong Kong Island at Victoria Harbour. So there, that's a nice concise way to sum it up. And basically I thought I would go for this one because it's, as it says, is a camel colour, which is lighter than the black and the brown versions of the standard um, Passport Midoris. And well, I just really like the look of this and the fact that it's got this Star Fairy tie-in has got, I don't know, it gives it a little um, sort of a little bit more of an interesting, curious uh, edge to it. So I suppose, without further ado, this is YouTube. We better give you a 360. Uh, make sure you check out my other videos because I have got an absolute ton of notebooks online at the minute. And well, I suppose the moment of truth is about to come when we flip this round and, well, open us up. Just a note here as well, you can see I've got some inserts, but I think we'll save those for another video as this is going to be big enough a video as it is just with this. So once again, you've got various information that you've seen and, well, I suppose, really, it's time to slide this out of here and really get down to business. Whoops. Absolutely fantastic. Also, up until the end of this year, if I do happen to be passing through um, the Hong Kong area, then I can uh, redeem this and have a free ride on the Star Ferry itself. <laughs> so that's useful, I'll keep that just in case. And now if we take this band off here. Well, here we go. Now, this here is all in Japanese, so I'm afraid I could not even begin to imagine what that says. Got a spare band there of a different colour to the one that's on it, I believe. And also this one here can be used as a spare band. Now in our nice little material bag and out we come. Oh, would you look at that? That is absolutely fantastic. That looks every bit as good as I was hoping it would look. And I'm very glad already that I've gone for the Star Edition. Particularly like the green band there and, well, like I say, the lighter colour. Sorry, I'm, I'm having a moment myself here as I just enjoy the initial um, unboxing that even I'm doing. <laughs> and I'm watching it in real time. So if we pop the band off, see it goes into the back there and is knotted. So obviously it keeps it all together but the band doesn't come out. Well, flipping heck, look at that. It's absolutely lovely. And if we just pull up closer here, hopefully you'll be able to see these details. There's your um, Star Edition embossing there with a few various bits and pieces written on. But hopefully you can see that on the video. So if we zoom back out um, and open this up, you'll see we've got this absolutely beautiful um, cover here, the uh, green and gold of the Star Fairy Edition uh, plain notebook. As you may know, the Midoris all come with a plain notebook insert. And, well, because this is the Star Edition, it's obviously got a little extra touch. And if you open it up and have a look at the first few pages, they've got all sorts of little bits and pieces. And, I don't know, curiosity is just the history of the, the Star Fairy. And, well, it's this sort of thing that I really like. I don't want to trivialise it because it's a very nice touch. But I'm a huge fan of history and it's just... These sorts of random little stories, sort of the snapshots of life in days gone by that I really enjoy. So 
this particular Midori really does seem seem tailored perfectly to me. And um, after you've obviously gone through those pages, it's just pretty much what you'd expect and just a plain notebook. If we just have a quick look at the back there, you'll see once again you've got your um, knot that holds the band that keeps it all together there and plain uh, back cover of the notebook. If we open it up to the centre of the notebook, you'll see we've got a bookmark here and also this is the elastic band that runs through the whole thing and basically that's how all of the inserts are kept in the cover. Um, I'll do a proper video showing you the proper setup of it and well like I say I've got all these inserts put in so we'll have a proper look at that in another video very soon so make sure you uh, check that out and well I suppose really it's got to be said this is just absolutely fantastic I mean I really do love the look of this I knew that this was going to be something I would instantly fall for when I saw it um, a few months ago on the internet and I've been umming and ahhing whether or not to get it. And well, now it's here. That looks absolutely fantastic. So, I suppose, before I carry on um, talking about how much I love this, because, well, this is just fantastic. I mean, just look at that. Um, I'll say thank you very much for watching. Make sure you stay tuned for my insert videos and a proper closer look at how the system works and obviously usage videos and setup videos down the line. I've got a huge amount of um, other notebooks um, and videos like that uh, already online and already waiting to be posted. So make sure you subscribe for a load more notebooks, file faxes, organisers and all that sort of stuff. So until the next time, thank you very much for watching and I will see you around soon. Farewell.